All right, announcements, uh, February 10th, uh, the ID project at Creekside Middle School. February the 11th is the ID project at Crossroads Middle School. February 14th is the progress reports for grades 1 through 12. Uh, February 17th is President's Day. There's no school. February 20th is a Business Advisory Council meeting at 1 p.m. at the Catholic Charities at 7162 Reading Road. Also, February 20th is a board meeting at 6.30 p.m. at the FHS Catherine D. Milligan Community Room. And February 22nd is the father-daughter dance at 7 p.m. in the FHS Arena, and tickets are going fast for that. All right, board member comments. Mrs. Gundrum. No comments. Thank no you. comments this evening. And Mrs. O'Neill. Um, I just wanted to thank you, Mr. Smith, for the um, State of the District update. Um, and just all the work that everybody's done to put into that to um, to show the state of the district, which was great. Yeah, that's it. And I'm going to cross my fingers for maybe a snow day. And <laughs> hope that people stay healthy. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Mr. Begley? I just want to thank Mr. Smith and uh, Mrs. Lane for your efforts on behalf of not just our school district, but all school districts in this Ed Choice fight. You've spent numerous days and nights in Columbus in the middle of it as a leader doing what needs to be done and saying what needs to be said, and I really appreciate that. Thank you. Yeah, I'll echo those sentiments because in talking to legislators this week, um, they said that the superintendents that really have led the charge, it really made them think about what this law and the effect that they have. They also said, that, of course, the letter writing campaign and all the phone calls, and I know Mrs. Shorter did a tremendous job spearheading that for our district, uh, getting parents involved, so that was great. Um, I went to the first look again this year, which uh, I kind of went solo because I had something else on Friday night or Saturday night when. Uh, my wife Susan took my two daughters and my two granddaughters, mm -hmm. and um, my two granddaughters just could not <laughs> get over the experience of that first look. And of course, we know how great it is, right? But it was it was great to see the excitement in their eyes. Them tell me about it on the Monday morning uh, after that about how great uh, thing that is. So I, again, they did a tremendous job. Our students are just so very talented. Um, our uh, Fairfield Township Youth Basketball League finals uh, for our high school students are this Saturday at 6 and 7.30 at the Freshman Building. And I tell you, those, <laughs> those guys are fun to watch play. And they a lot of students come out and watch them, and it's free, uh, free to come in and see that. So I, I encourage people to come to that. Of course, I don't, I'm not pressing uh, Bob to get this uh, video out in time for people to hear about it. So... <laughs> Um, but hopefully a lot of people come out for that. And I want to congratulate the academic team. How great is that? Um, mm -hmm. My son was on the academic team when he was here, and, and you know, at times they feel like they're kind of the, you know, the stepchild that's never appreciated. And I know that um, uh, Mr. Smith, and uh, our athletic director, have made a big deal about them, and I, and I appreciate that, and my son appreciates that, and our community appreciates it because they can see all the athletes that we have, not just the physical athletes, but the mental athletes that we have as well. So uh, that's great. And so that's all the comments I have tonight. And uh, so there is a need to recess to executive session uh, for the employment and discipline of public employees uh, under Ohio Revised Code 121.22 G1, court action 121.22 G3, pending or imminent litigation, and collective bargaining under 121.22 G4. So at this time, I will obtain a motion to recess into executive session. So moved. Second. Any comments or questions? Mrs. Lane, will you call the roll, please? Mrs. Gundrum? Yes. Mr. Beg Begley? Yes. Mr. Birdie? Yes. Mrs. O'Neill? Yes. Motion passes. We recess into executive session at 8.28 p.m. Thank you all very much.